Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and just stumbling upon this video, my name is Kirsten and I typically post home decor and lifestyle content. So if that interests you, then feel free to stick around and subscribe to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to chat a little bit about what's new in West Elm. So I actually haven't browsed the West Elm site in quite some time, basically since I first moved into this apartment because I really focused on buying everything that I needed for the apartment and it kind of got a little out of control. <laughs> I love home decor, so I really filled up the space. So like I said, I hadn't been on the website in a while, but recently I just kind of felt like browsing through. They actually gave me a $25 gift card for my birthday, so I figured why not check some things out and I can use that gift card towards the purchase. But I ended up coming across some really nice things that I thought why not share it with you all in case you are interested in furnishing your own home or in buying some fresh pieces for your home. So let's go ahead and jump right in and I can share all of the things that kind of caught my eye when I was looking online. So I do have some bigger furniture items as well as some smaller home pieces that you can purchase. Now keep in mind that with West Elm, their furniture tends to be a little overpriced. So take all of this with a grain of salt and save your money if you can. But the first piece that I wanted to share is the Lofted Boucle Dining Chair. Boucle is all the rage lately. I absolutely love Boucle and I've wanted to kind of incorporate it into my space. I think the more practical way for me is in like a throw pillow or a blanket just because I don't have a lot of opportunities for that here. But this dining chair is like the dining chair of my dreams. If I did have a dining table, I would be all over this chair. <laughs> I love it so much. I just love the structure of it. I feel like the color, the creamy tone, the boucle fabric is just so beautiful and tasteful. I feel like it's also one of those pieces that can really fit in with a lot of home decor styles. So it can fit into a farmhouse uh, home. It could fit into a more modern home. It just really is suitable for lots of different home decor styles. So this piece is probably one of my favorites of the new collection. Another piece that caught my eye almost right away is the Solstice coffee table. This one really reminds me of the horseshoe table from CB2. I've heard some mixed reviews about that. It looks beautiful, but then it kind of chips easily. So this is a nice alternative. It's got that really nice waterfall detail. I just love, again, the cream color. You know I love the muted tones, the neutral tones. So this table is really, really beautiful. I have a sectional, so I don't think this table would fit in quite well with my sectional, but if you have kind of just a regular couch, I think this would be the perfect addition to your space. They also have this in a console table version, if that's more your vibe, so definitely check it out. I really think it's a great piece. Another coffee table that I've had my eye on for a long time, you know my current table is marble and round. Their new version of this is the Maddox coffee table. It's the perfect kind of blending of that more marble stone finish with the wooden base and I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. It is a bit expensive, but West Elm is known to make really quality products, so you are investing in a piece that'll last you many years. Okay, next up is the Scarlet Ottoman. This is very structured. It's kind of got a square shape to it, but I really love that about it. It's super modern if that's your style and it comes in a variety of colors. So I do like this rust tone that they advertise on the website, but it also comes in gray, cream, basically any color that you can name, they have it. Another great thing about this piece is that they also have the matching chair on the website. So you can kind of put them together as a set or keep them as separate pieces and you have yourself a really nice addition to your home. I also find that ottomans are super versatile, so you can use it as an ottoman, but you can also use it as extra seating, you can move it around the room. It's just a really great piece to have. The next piece that I came across is not like a traditional piece that I would get, but I think it's perfect for a smaller space if you have like a studio like me or a one bedroom and you're trying to make the most use out of your space. It is the Kiki floating nightstand. It's funny because Kiki actually was my nickname in middle school and it's kind of translated with me throughout my adult life as well. So this is the perfect piece. <laughs> it's got that clean white finish on the top and then this really deep wood base and I love wood. I'm like all about wood lately and I don't have much of it in my apartment so I'm trying to add more wooden tones here and there. But I really think this floating nightstand is great if you want to make more use out of your wall space and not take up a lot of floor space. It can also be used as a desk if you work from home 
and it's also a nice area just to add some more decor and elevate your space. Another big furniture piece that caught my attention was the ridged base coffee table. This is a very grand piece, so it's definitely a statement item. It's got that fluted detail on the legs, and it's got just this really cool dark color and texture that it brings. So it's definitely a statement piece and you have to kind of live in a bigger space, I think, for this coffee table. It measures 55 inches wide, so definitely measure your space if you're interested in this table. You kind of also need a bigger couch, I think, to kind of balance it out. But this table has such a beautiful silhouette, I think will really kind of make a statement in any home. The next piece that I wanted to share is the Fondry Low Console Table. This is a piece that you can use as a media stand or just as a console as it's described. It measures 60 inches wide, so just under what my current media unit is. Um, and it's got that really nice winter wood finish, which I think is a staple for West Elm furniture pieces. It gives you that texture without adding too much color if you don't like your space to look too busy. And then it has really nice gold hardware to kind of complete the look. It makes it feel super elevated, super classic, and it's really just a beautiful piece. It's not too overwhelming to the eye, and it has some pull-out drawers as well as some storage underneath where you can utilize for more home decor. So if you're currently looking for media stands, check this one out. I think it's a really great find. Okay, so I did say I wanted to mix in some smaller pieces rather than having all large furniture items. So something that caught my eye on the West Elm website was the glass decanters with wood stoppers. This is so perfect for a bar area. I just think the fact that they're glass, they're really solid and sturdy, classy, they'll never go out of style. And then with the wood stoppers, it just makes it look super, super nice and perfect for hosting. So it really is just the perfect item to kind of dress up your bar cart and impress your friends when you have guests over. I always like when I'm hosting to feel kind of fancy with the barware that I'm choosing. So this is definitely a piece that'll get you there. Okay, another piece that I've been eyeing and kind of really, really wanted, but I've been holding off on are these decorative wooden arches. They come as a set of three and I just think they look so cute together. This comes in more of a light wooden tone and I really want to bring that rich wood color into my home so I wasn't too sure about it but I love the arch. I love that there's three pieces so you can kind of switch them around. You don't have to keep them together but you can. You can kind of play around with it and switch things up if you want to so I really love that about them. I think they're a great kind of piece to have when you just have some empty space on a shelf they're perfect to style your bookshelves with and just another thing that I've had my eye on. Okay, next I have to talk to you about the lofted oak bed. This bed is the perfect bed if you're more of like a minimalist and really like clean lines, clean slates. This bed is super kind of just is very thin. It's got really clean lines as I said before. It's that beautiful medium toned wood and then the base legs come in more of like a black tone. They're very thin, very sleek. So again, perfect for that minimalist style. And yeah, I love my bed, but as an alternative, I think this is a great piece and will look really cool and kind of brighten up your space. Okay, next up, I have these really cool glasses. They're super different and I'm gonna look at my computer so that I don't mess up the name. They're called the Bormioli Rocco Cassiopeia Bar Glasses. <laughs> So they come in a set of four. Like I said, they have a really cool kind of dynamic shape to them and they're currently on sale. So run, do not walk to get these glasses. I have so much barware and so many glasses that I feel like I wouldn't even have the space for them, but these are calling my name. So if you like them too, definitely get them now while they're on sale. You know West Elm. They don't often have sales, so you gotta get them while you can. I also found these really cool fluted sconces. So the sconces that I have behind me right above my bed are also from West Elm, but these sconces that I found are just kind of a different take. They are fluted and I love everything fluted at the moment. I've got a lot of fluted barware, a lot of fluted vases, everything fluted. So this sconce is the perfect touch if you wanna kind of 
put them on either side of your bed just like I did. Sconces are also really beautiful above artwork or in an entryway. So there's lots of opportunities for use for these sconces and I thought they were really beautiful when I saw them. So I did mention earlier that if I were to kind of introduce boucle into my home, it would be in the form of a pillow or a throw. And I did kind of find a little alternative option for that. This is called the Cozy Faux Shearling Oversized Lumbar Pillow. So they come in two shades. One is more of a creamy color and the other is more of a beigey taupe. And I think both are beautiful. I love both of these and I love that they're a longer lumbar pillow. You can do a lot with them. You can put them on your bed, you can put them on your couch. They are perfect and again, another more affordable option for introducing boucle into your environment. When I was looking through the website, I was looking for some nightstands. I love my nightstand from West Elm and I feel like they haven't made many new ones in a while, but then I found this Chadwick nightstand. So this is giving me very bohemian vibes. So it's got that wood with that kind of wrapped around rope that's weaved throughout the bottom. And that's super trendy for the bohemian home decor style. Just thought this would be really nice beside your bed. Um, I'm using my nightstand as an end table, so you can also do that. But this is definitely a nice clean piece to use in your home. Another piece that I highly recommend, this is actually one that I've recommended to my mom's friend who is currently trying to switch up her decor in her apartment. It's the Monty Lava Stone Coffee Table. This one is one of their most affordable coffee tables I find. Usually their coffee tables go upwards of $700. This one is around the $500 price mark, so it's really good quality, but also more affordable than their other ones. I love kind of how it like slopes inward and then has that really cool base. It's just such a good coffee table. It is made of stone, so it can go with anything. And I actually saw the side table version of it in store and really wanted that one. Again, if I had more space, I would be all over these pieces, but I just really don't have much space to add anything else in. So for now, they'll have to stay online, but maybe when I move, I'll end up revisiting this because these pieces are just so beautiful and I can't pass them up. So for more barware, I came across the Horizon lead-free glassware and these are like wine glasses, but I actually prefer the stemless version. I think it's really cute. It's got that wide bottom and then that sleeker top. And I just love how minimal it is. I think it's the perfect kind of glassware just for a drink, for water. You can pretty much use it for anything. So I definitely would recommend these. They're lead free. They're made of glass. You can't go wrong. Lately, I've been seeing carafes everywhere. Everyone's using them on their nightstands, on their bedside tables. It's basically just a bottle and a cup. You set it together on your nightstand and you can refill your water cup at night if you get thirsty. And this bedside table and carafe set from West Elm is super cute. It's a little curvy, but also super minimal. It's just the perfect set. So if you're looking for a carafe, this is definitely a nice option. This is also nice to give as a gift for the holidays. It's kind of something that you don't think about so much, but having water by your bed is an essential um, and key for a good night's sleep, I think. So a carafe set is definitely a nice gift for you or for your loved ones. I ended up also looking through West Elm's pillows and they still have a lot of the pillows that I purchased from them last year but I actually saw one pillow that was new, at least to me, and it caught my eye. It's the Bold Center Mixed Stripe Pillow Cover. This one really feels very vintage, very kind of old school and just used and lived in. I absolutely love the tones. It's got those earthy tones. It's also pretty textured and has a stripe pattern to it. It's just the perfect pillow to kind of add something to your couch. A lot of people are into the cream couches lately. Mine is like gray, so if you're looking to add some more pattern and texture, this is the way to go. Last but not least, I came across this super cute Crosley solo radio. I hope I'm pronouncing that right, Crosley. I think that's how you say it, but this Crosley solo radio. It is gorgeous, stunning, beautiful. It again has that wood around it, which you know I love so much. It's got the cream tones in the front and just like such a cute concept to have a radio in your apartment. You know, we're all about our speakers nowadays, but it also kind of just brings me back to the old days to have a radio with like an antenna, an actual antenna that you can pull out and 
I just think it's super pretty also just to have as decor it's definitely a piece you know I like having a lot of pieces that don't really do anything but just look pretty in the home that's just me but this is also really nice and you can use it to play music as well Alrighty guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the video there. I absolutely love West Elm as I'm sure you already know so I could honestly go on forever talking about their pieces but I feel like I've given you guys a pretty good mix of high-end big furniture items as well as some little knickknacks that you can kind of add if you're trying to save your money. So definitely feel free to browse their website. I will leave all of these pieces linked down below as well. And I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again in the next one. Bye.